as a Gosford Paw, many people's favorite Bob Waltman film. Mm. When you meet Bob Waltman, does he give you this, does he give you a script or he works from no script at all? Just the flow of the movie, it has its own tempo. It was a script, nobody understood it. Okay. Um, <laughs> Maggie, Maggie Smith asked me what it was, what, what it was about, and I said, no idea. She said, oh, fuck, she said, you don't know who does. <laughs> 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 um, but he gives this amazing speech, and someone else, I can't remember, can't remember who it was who was in it, had been in a Bob Orton film before. Uh, oh, Richie Grant, who had been in, I think, Preta Porte. And, and he said, um, Bob gives this speech. He said, Listen, I, I'm, I'm not an actor, I'm a, I, I'm a director. I started on TV, I started up in galleries uh, mixing, um, and uh, I know how to move cameras, I, I, and I know how to make people look good, I know how to make a scene. I don't know how to act, I don't know how you guys do it, I, could, I can't do it. So I'm not going to tell you how to do it, because you know how to do it. That's why you're here. Um, but I may come up and say, are those the shoes you're going to wear? No. Uh, or I may say, you have your, have your jacket off? It's just something <laughs> practical. Huh? Um, and we all thought, okay, that's, that's, that's nice. He's kind of trusting. He's just saying that. And he liked to have two cameras all, all the time. Uh, and he liked both cameras to be able to track. Uh, which is extremely difficult usually because you know, you'd start rehearsing and the cameras would bump into each other and <laughs> each one would look at the other camera and each other. But slowly, suddenly and extraordinarily, as you rehearse the scene, this kind of ballet emerged of movement, and co of dialogue and conversation and freedom. And everybody started having the best time of their lives. And actors had had, um, I won't mention the names, very well known actors who'd had a, a fuse and hadn't spoken for 15 years were hugging each other and sipping champagne and, and, and made up. Um, um, yes. He had this wonderful tent at lunchtime where he showed the dailies, and he clapped and laughed and roared through the dailies himself. When asked what the film was about, he says, it's a, it's a whodunit where nobody gives a who, who did it. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> and we just had the best time. And I suppose I ought to add, he smoked weed all the way through. <laughs> 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 